Michael Saylor alerts Bitcoin community amid rising tide of deepfake scams. Involve equals such a sender origin SRC equals HTTPS slash slash sim co slash author slash 989 slash responsive images slash SS media library original 300 375. JPG class equals in fluid in circle loading equals auto such a sender origin. Last updated January 15, 2024 22 18 ESD1 min read. Disclosure. Crypto is a high-risk asset class. This article is provided for informational purposes and does not constitute investment advice. By using this website, you agree to our terms and conditions. We may utilize affiliate links within our content and receive commission. MicroStrategy founder and tech titan Michael Saylor has issued a warning about the influx of AI-generated deepfake scams in the Bitcoin community. The alarm follows several reports last week flagging fake AI-generated videos of Saylor reportedly promising to double people's money instantly. The fake ad prompted customers to scan a QR code to send Bitcoin BTC to the perpetrator's address. One user posted on X formerly Twitter that Michael Saylor's deepfake video popped up on YouTube again. In response, Saylor wrote on Sunday that there is no risk-free way to double your Bitcoin. MicroStrategy doesn't give away BTC to those who scan a barcode, he stressed. Further, he revealed that his security team takes down 80 deepfake videos per day, on average, that depict Sailor's fake crypto promises. My team takes down about 80 fake AI-generated YouTube videos every day, but the scammers keep launching more. Don't trust, verify. Sailor's scam videos followed a suite of convincing-looking deepfake video trend in the recent past. In November 2023, Fake videos of Ripple and its chief Brad Garland house surfaced with fake XRP giveaways. Similarly, Cardano co-founder Charles Hoskinson fell victim to deepfake in December, which followed an immediate warning from him on the increasing sophistication of these fake videos. Combating crypto deepfakes The rapidly evolving AI technology masks a grim reality, security and privacy concerns. A UCL report said that experts have ranked manipulated video slash audio as the most worrying use of artificial intelligence in terms of its applications for crime. Matt Goro, a research assistant with the Effective Computing Group at the MIT Media Lab, said that people can defend themselves against falling victim to deepfakes by using their own intellect. You have to be a little skeptical, you have to double-check and be thoughtful, Gro said.